YouTube subscribers and friends, welcome to my channel. Happy New Year! It is the first day of the new year. The first video of the new year. Check out these beautiful mountain views. It's got a slight breeze. It's 60 degrees out. Man, it feels like springtime. Beautiful day today in shorts and a t-shirt. Man, I love living in Arizona. The weather is beautiful. You can't beat this weather. Now, I'm on a trail I haven't been on in a long time. Normally I go that way, but there's a trail going this way that I've never been on. So that's the direction I'm going to go today. I'm going to uh, just get a short walk out today, get my exercise, and uh, because I'm feeling great, although I still have this annoying cough. Uh, if I get out and get too physical, my chest hurts a little bit, and I can't stop coughing. So. I just been taking these walks since I've been feeling better. Actually, I actually haven't stopped because I walk every day whether I'm sick or not. But it was really, really hard when we were up in Pine Top and I was doing my walking. I would come back, my chest would hurt really bad. So I'm just going to stay on the trail here and take a walk. Taking this beautiful scenery because it is such a nice day out today. The weather and the sunshine. There's that mountain I climbed. Uh, close Encounter Mountains I call. Climbed to the tippy 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 top last year. Can't believe it's been a year already. Right? 2017 was a good year. Went by so fast. Seems like the older you get, the faster the years go by. Yep. 2018. Man. Don't know what I'm gonna do this year, 2018. Look at that. Boom. That looks cool. Swear to me. Uh, I think I might get a new camera. I don't know what kind I'm gonna get. I haven't been to Best Buy in such a long time. I used to like to go there all the time and check out the new uh, electronics. But I haven't done that in forever. I haven't even made a video of doing that. <laughs> yep, one out got me a got me a pistol. A pistola. How you say in Spanish? Pistola. Keep myself protected out here in this wildlife. This is a nice desert trail right here. It's got a lot of a lot of horse tracks here. There is somebody else parked out there where I'm parked, out here hiking. I guess they couldn't resist this beautiful weather we're having here in Arizona also. Look at this. Somebody is out here freaking barefooted. Look at that. You see that? That is a barefoot print right there. There's another one right here. There's the left one right there that I stepped on. They are crazy walking. I almost stepped on a cactus back there barefoot. Who is walking out here barefooted? There's another barefoot. Let me see. This is a size 10 shoe. It's just a little bit longer than what I'm doing. Let's see if I can see any more. I don't know if the camera's going to pick it up. There's a left footprint right here. You can see where the toes dug into the sand there. That is crazy. There's another left foot there. I'm not saying it's a big foot. All I'm saying is they got a giant arch right here. You can see this is goes like that. It's really narrow foot too. Man, you, you see all kinds of crazy things out here in this desert. There's another one right there. I don't think that is a real big footprint. I think that's a human footprint because it doesn't have the break in the ball of the foot like most big footprints have. But they're crazy to be walking out here in the desert barefooted. I'm in an area where there's a lot of Joshua cactus and 
Toya cactuses. Yeah, I feel, I feel for you people out there in uh, winter wonderland having to deal with those minus 12, minus 20 degrees below zero weather, 6 inches, 12 inches of snow. That stuff is crazy, man. I've seen the YouTube videos. People being snowed in and can't get out of their own driveway and stuff like that. And I just, oh man, I, I just talked to my wife. I was like, man, I am so glad we do not live in that kind of weather. It's just crazy. Look, horse poop. <coughs> That's why I love Arizona weather so much, man. It's just, here it is, January 1st, 2018. The first day of the year, and it's 65 degrees. We've got a high today of 74, they said. And it's just so freaking beautiful out right now. It is not cold at all. It is, this is the perfect weather. <coughs> I still have to get rid of that annoying cough I have, though. Other than that, I feel about 85%. I feel it more at nighttime. The coughing, the irritation. I mean, the barefoot still come way out here. It's a nice little easy trail to walk on, taking baby steps, continuing to get my exercise, but not overdo it and get myself even more sick. Yeah, it's a terrible flu everybody's been getting. Look at these big Ocotilla cactuses here. Huge. Let me get a view here from the, the sun. And uh, we got a couple of clouds and stuff, but not too many. Not too bad. This is a nice trail. I've never been on this trail before. So what are my plans for 2018? I have no idea. I really don't have any plans. I don't really set, uh, what do they call them, uh, resolution, New Year's resolutions. I don't, I don't really do that because nobody ever falls through with the resolutions. They stick to them for like a week and, and then that's it. They go back to their old habits. It takes 28 days to start a new habit. If you can stick to a new habit past 28 days, then it will no longer be a habit, it'll be a routine. So, so say like, uh, I'm going to start exercising. If you exercise every single day for 28 days to the 29th day, it no longer will be a chore for you, it'll just be a routine. Something that's easy for you to do. Hey, I could have parked right here. I had no clue. This is a definite horse trail. A lot of Ocotillo cactuses in here. So some of the things I am planning on doing, this is this is this is why you don't walk barefooted in the desert. See that? You can kick that. Oh man, that'll ruin your day. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, I am shopping for a new vehicle. I've mentioned that before in 2017, even the hangouts that I've been in. Uh, the new thing is, I would really love to get a new camera. I use the Sony H uh, DCXR or CRX, something like that, 440 with 60 times zoom. So I'm able to zoom in like this and get such great detail of that mountain. That's not even full zoom. That's full zoom right there. It might help if I put the tripod down. That's full zoom right there. That's 60 times zoom. That's why I don't like using a GoPro because 
you can't zoom with the GoPro and GoPros have that fisheye look. I don't know how many miles I am from that, but that's why I love these Sony Handycams. They're so, they can fit in your pocket. And uh, this one has stabilization in it. But uh, yeah, just look at them mountain views. So beautiful. <laughs> so beautiful. Uh. So the next camera I get, I still want to stick with Sony. I just, I just don't know what's out there yet. I don't want to carry a big Canon camera like my son has, or like Casey Neistat uses, anything like that. Those are just too biggy, too, too big, too big, too bulky, and uh, I don't like using them. And these are tough little cameras too. This is, uh, like I said, the 440, um, 60 time zoom. Wi-Fi capabilities, beautiful. Look at that. Just zoom. How can I do this with the GoPro? You can't do this. You can't zoom in and see the beauty. I definitely want to get a different vehicle. Uh, I don't know what I'm going to do with Vader, but. Uh, it was uh, something I wanted to try out. I wanted to try out a minivan. Because I get bored of my vehicles. But, uh, new year, need a new vehicle. That's, that's how I think, right? I don't know. I wanted to get an SUV, but man, my wife keeps showing me fancy cars, like Cadillacs and Lexus and stuff like that, which are all nice cars. Don't get me wrong, I like them. It just, when they break down, they become very expensive to have to fix to repair. And uh, I'm still seeing those bare footprints all on this trail here. So, but I do not know what I'm going to get. But uh, same with the uh, hangouts. People ask me what I'm going to do with the hangouts. I don't know. Anything about it. I may still do them. I may do them maybe once a month. I haven't decided yet. But uh, also the giveaways, I might start doing those again. I haven't decided yet. It's a new year. First day of the new year. A lot of thinking to do still. I'm going to continue to try to uh, beat this diabetes. Um, I do control my sugar levels pretty good. And uh, hopefully uh, I'll be able to reverse it. It's not easy, but you got to stick to it, right? 28 days to start a new habit or routine. Uh, I'm coming to the end of this trail. Time to... Huh? I'm sorry? What did you say? Turn around and go back. Comes up to a main road. Look at these swirls. That's the main road. I'm going to go to there and turn around and walk back. I only wanted to get like a 20 minute walk in today. Because you walk 20 minutes and then you got to turn around, you got to walk 20 minutes back. That's 40 minutes. That's a good enough exercise. And then I uh, got to go to work. Boom, tag, you're it. Alright, time to turn around. Look at them views. Yep, I walked exactly 25 minutes one way. And I tracked the barefoots all the way to the main road. I don't know who would be crazy enough to walk out here barefooted. Not me. Because it is painful getting these cactus in your feet. 
Just look at them. They're scattered across the trail. That's why I have to keep looking down when I'm walking because I'll kick them if I'm not paying attention. Just look at those views. I would love to get a Jeep. I've been wanting a Jeep forever, but I think what's going to happen is I'm going to have to wait till my kids grow up and move out before I actually get me a Jeep. Because I can get me a BMW or a Lexus SUV way cheaper than it's going to cost to get a four-door Jeep. It's crazy. And there's no room in a four-door Jeep for me and my family. We wouldn't try tried it out. It just there's no room and like I said before the back seat will not recline and my wife doesn't like that so I think my Jeep dreams are gonna be put on hold till my kids move away and then once my kids grow up and move out I give me a two-door Jeep so actually I want a Hummer but then my wife's like well that's too big first she says it's too small and then she says it's too big I would love to have a Hummer. I almost bought a Hummer when we first moved to Arizona. And then I said, ah, you know what, let me, let me buy a house first. And that's what I did. Keep putting my dreams on hold. You gotta stop putting your dreams on hold, man. I can't believe it is January 1st, 2018. It's winter time. I'm out here in shorts and a t-shirt. This beautiful sunshine taking in this beautiful trail hike today and just what <clears throat> a week ago I was sick as a dog I mean I was chest pains coughing <laughs> so bad high fever you can see these footprints really clearly here these are actually smaller these are there's two people walking out here barefoot these are like tiny tiny that is crazy. This is a tiny footprint compared to that other one, which is bigger than my foot. What was I talking about? I completely forgot. That's another thing I'm going to work on 2018. Work on my memory. And then uh, maybe start taking some ginkgo globa. <laughs> That's funny. My wife put me on that ginkgo globa one time and I kept forgetting to take the ginkgo globa. Yet my memory kept getting better. I don't need no stinking ginkgo globa. It's very quiet out here today, man. I woke up, I went out in my front yard and I found all kinds of fireworks in my front yard. I don't know where they came from. Those like bottle rocket type fireworks. Like three or four of them in my driveway. I actually stayed up really, really late last night in the hangout, Sunflowers Hangout. Wishing everybody Happy New Year's. Maybe I'll get some new editing software too. Who knows? It's a new year. It's got a clean slate of things to do. <sighs> Been an excellent hike this morning. Although my voice sounds pretty bad, believe me, I'm feeling much, much better. Look at these mountain views over here. The 360 degree view where I'm at. See that cactus right there? I almost kicked right there. See that? And you're walking out here barefooted, you silly rabbit. There's another one right there you can barely see. And look at all these by the trail. I wish I could see this person. I could actually see this person walking out here barefooted. I understand that you want to be one with the Mother Earth, but that's crazy. Beautiful. This is called Panther Mountain right here. Panther Ridge or something like that.
nothing like getting out into the nature, getting in your exercise and taking in this beautiful, beautiful weather. Man, what is this song? I forgot the song already. Mr. Sun, Sun, please come out for me. Come shine down on me. I'm Mr. Sun, Sun, please come out for me. Shine down on me. That's the, uh, my wife told me that's a Barney song from the show Barney, the kid show. It's actually very addictive. I put that on my Instagram. Don't know if you guys saw that, but a rabbit just ran out. Scared the tar out of me. Good thing I got this pistola with me today. I had to scare him back. I didn't shoot the kill, I just shoot to scare him. That's all. Well, this I walked a lot farther than I thought I did. It's amazing how far you can walk in 25 minutes. Well, see my vehicle there there's a tiny little bird right over there come to the end of my walk if you're new to my channel welcome I want to thank everybody for taking the time to watch my videos as always remember if you like these kind of videos hit that like button and uh, if you haven't subscribed already Come on, man. It's the new year, 2018. What are you waiting for? Smash that subscribe button. It don't cost you anything. It's free. And, uh, I gotta go to work. Get, get, get. I'm gone. <laughs>